Dear friends in Christ, today is day three of the Novena to the Holy Spirit. Here at St. James, we have this beautiful stained glass window over the altar that has a wonderful depiction of the dove, a classic symbol of the Holy Spirit. The dove hovering over the altar, the place of sacrifice. What does the dove mean? What does this symbol teach us? Well, we first encounter the dove, of course, in the account of, of Noah. Noah, at the end of the flood, sends a dove from the ark. The dove returns with the olive branch in, in its beak. And that has become a, a symbol of peace, even in a secular world, because it signified the reconciliation between God and man, that the, 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 the waters of the flood had, had rid the world of sin, and now there was a new beginning between God and man. And the, the dove was the expression of that, the symbol of it. Then, of course, we encounter the dove at our Lord's baptism. St. Luke tells us that the dove descended in bodily form and hovered over our Lord. And again, it's to announce reconciliation between God and man. And our Lord brings that definitive reconciliation. The Holy Spirit continues to accomplish that within us. And that is what the dove teaches us, that he is always reconciling us with the Father, that no matter how much we stray, the Holy Spirit draws us back. He convicts us of, uh, convicts us of sin. He leads our hearts to repentance. And finally, by his grace, he restores us to the Father. And so we continue praying to the Holy Spirit that he will accomplish these things, that he will, that he will convict us of sin so that we can then in turn repent and so that we can then understand and appreciate more that reconciliation with the Father by which we have been made the children of God. God bless.